welcome back. Now our next cutie is a beautiful flame point named Biscuit. Uh, I don't think I've seen a Siamese kitty so light, Bree. So a lot of the time they're born almost all white. And as a pointed Siamese kitty, they get their points and they turn darker and darker. My very first cat was a flame point, red point Siamese like this one. And so I have very fond memories of over the years, because she lived to be over 20, uh, she was darker and darker as the years went on. So just absolutely beautiful kitten. This little one was found as a stray, and a good Samaritan realized that he was under the weather and not feeling well and had a, a kitty cold. So they brought him over to AHS, and we took really good care of him. And there's something to be said about... Uh, making sure that you bring the pets in, especially if you think they might be sick, uh, we're able to care for them and help you. Definitely, and they're opposite of us. We get lighter and lighter as we, our hair gets lighter and lighter. Now Chevy is a happy-go-lucky dude who could be a great cuddle buddy, Perry. Oh, absolutely. This little guy, little guy again, was turned in. His family had a new baby in the house and they just didn't feel they could devote enough time to that little baby. And this 97-pound baby right here, she is ex he is extremely cute. He knows all of his basic sit, stay, paw. If you're interested in training, you have a few days left. Go to our website, azumaine dot org slash training put in the code sit for 20 and you're going to get yourself a 20 percent discount off of our training classes thank you so much and now four score and seven years ago this bun bun was rescued well maybe not that long ago please tell us about lincoln lisa lincoln is a petite little all-white female rabbit very very hand tame you can tell that she's really been around a lot of people <laughs> we even considered her for our education department Do's and don'ts, real quick for rabbits. They love leafy greens. As you can see, she's eating the top of a carrot. Um, avocados are a never, and anything that is high fat and high carbs are also on the do not feed your bunny list. Awesome, thank you so much. And that's it for today's show. If you have any questions about the pets, make sure you visit that website right there. And as always, we appreciate your support every week for saving the adorable lives like you've seen on today's show. That's it, right here at Pets on Parade. We'll see you next week.